And welcome back to Hannity. Joining me now for an exclusive interview to talk about the rise in racial tension across America following the acquittal of George Zimmerman is the NAACP's Washington Bureau Director and Senior Vice President for Advocacy, Hillary Shelton. Hillary, thank you for being here. Oh, it's my honor. Thank you for having me. Appreciate it. Uh, all right. You don't like the verdict. Am I right on that? No, not at all. We think it is wrong. Quite frankly, if you look at the facts, we know there's some real problems in how this case came out. First, we're looking at a very faulty self-defense policy in the state of Florida, one that allows someone to be stalked, assaulted, and then shoot someone to death, even if they're unarmed, and get away with it. That's a major problem in America. It's a problem in those laws in Florida. Even if we know, if even stand your ground had been added, stand your ground is a policy that has actually led to, over the last five years, an increase in so-called self-defense homicides by over 300 percent. There's a real problem in our country is moving towards the old wild, wild west policies in which someone must shoot first to be able to survive through the day. You say stalked and assaulted as though that was, that was a fact. First of all, George Zimmerman's absolutely. a neighbor. It, that is George it's Zimmerman. absolutely a fact, Sean. It's absolutely a fact. They're not, they're, uh, well, it wasn't facts presented in the case. I followed this sure. very closely. The facts of the case are George Zimmerman's a community watch guy. Is it not, if he sees somebody, if you see somebody in your own neighborhood you don't recognize, would you call the police? Well, let's talk about community watch. Number one, That's not what I asked community, watch, community watch policies coming out of the Justice Department, the NAACP worked very closely in the 1990s when we had a major problem with crime across the country to get community organizations involved in providing greater protection in our neighborhoods. Those policies included two points that George Zimmerman seems to totally ignore. Number one, community watch are not supposed to engage in trying to stop crimes from happening, but simply to report them to the police. Number two, Community watch are never supposed to be armed at all, but that's what happened in this case. In essence, if he was a community watch captain, he clearly had not read the policies or Hillary, ignored them altogether. Hillary, it's yes, not sir. illegal to get out of your car if you see somebody suspicious. The gun he had was legal, and I'll read to you from well, the. I'll well, read. I'll you read hang on. I'll read no, to you no, from oh, the sure. justifiable use of deadly force. And the instructions uh, to the and, jury. And, and the it's state a, of Florida, I hope. Good. And the state of Florida. If George Zimmerman okay. was not engaged in an unlawful activity, and he was not, and he was attacked in any place where he had a right to be, he was punched in the face and then ground and pound, he had, a du he had no duty to retreat and had the right to stand his ground and meet force with force, including deadly force, if he thought it was necessary to prevent death and great bodily harm to himself or another. Now, whether you, Look, whether you, that's let's, the let's law take, of Florida, whether you like sure, it or not, that's that, the law. That's the law. Let's take a couple steps back. You said earlier in the, in the uh, show that very well you know that George Zimmerman had been watching Trayvon Martin. He'd been stalking him. He got That's in his car stalking. and started. It, is it not, not stalking? stalking? I, is stalking not when you're following someone around? No. He, he called into the police as he was following him around. And they now, said, me, where let, is he let, now? Let, they let, encouraged let's take, let's take him to look. look. And, and he told him. And the police said, thanks, we got it. We're sending out a cruiser. Because right. the police know that the policies for community watch groups are not to intervene. But everyone knows that, that Mr. Zimmerman intervened. As a matter of fact, if you look at the testimony of Trayvon Martin's girlfriend, she said very clearly that she heard Mr. Zimmerman saying, who are you? What are you doing wait, here? Wait, wait. She and also said today, wait, this, wait, this is important. As Mr. At, she it, also listen, said no, that she believes that Trayvon punched him first and initiated the contact. Now, let me ask you this. If very well, if Trayvon Martin is walking along the way, and if Mr. Zimmerman came in and stood in front of him to stop him, most likely he'd probably put his hands up to say stop because he said, wait, That's who a guess. are you? What are They're you guessing. doing here? Well, well let, let me say this. If we're only going to go on the guy that shot him to death's testimony, we have a real problem. Let me, because but, but here's essence, what you're missing. But, you have, but wait, not, but you're no, forgetting you're one not thing. You are not putting together the I'm story that came together. out. I'm looking at the well, evidence, well, and the well, jury well, agreed well, with well, me. Help. But help, help, help walk through. The, the jury decided on very narrow facts not how narrow. the outcome of this case should come out. Yep. Now, the, the jury not was not told to, to think about the fact that he was being followed. The jury was they not told, told to consider the told. fact he that did, indeed. There's no denying that. Oh, the, right, the, the look, jury look, talked here's about, what you're missing, no, though. You're missing, at, at, you're missing at an point, important it, fact. Let me, let me help you out here. I'd I, I love because, to hear this fact, Sean. Because, but, share with me. All right, I'm going I'm, I'm to help share with you because I think Thank it was a terrible tragedy. Hillary, oh, absolutely. Look, I think I think this was a misunderstanding. There, there's that not a father in America that is not scared to death of what just happened here for our children. But what I think you're I'm, missing, let me let me get this in. Oh, what oh, I think oh, you're I'm, missing I'm, here please. is 
is that George Zimmerman had a right to be there. That gun was legal. Yes, he did. And but Trayvon, he did not have a hang right. On, he did not have thought. a right. He did not have a right to intervene with uh, with Trayvon Martin. Wait a he minute. did not have he, that right to put no his hands on him. But there's no evidence to support that. We know that Trayvon Martin punched him and broke his nose. And the eyewitness, the one eyewitness Sean, in the case, hang on, the one eyewitness in the case has please. Trayvon. Bam, bam, straddling MMA ground and pound. Now, Why do you ignore that like, like a, Congressman there, Rush? I'm not ignoring that, but I'm also not ignoring what happened as we moved to that point. As we moved to that point, at what point did George Zimmerman intervene with Trayvon Martin? At what point? Right, let me ask another question. We've got to move on. No, no, no. Right, help, help me with this. I'll at what you. point when he walked up did he intervene with Trayvon Martin? Well, what, at what point? Uh, the, do, listen, do you believe that, do you know. believe that, Here's the answer. that based on the conversation, you, you based, don't know the answer, based on the conversation, the, you asked based me a on the conversation with the girlfriend, the girlfriend said she overheard you know, like Chris George, Matthews. George Zimmerman's <laughs> voice, thank you so much, overheard George Zimmerman's voice asking Trayvon, who are you? What are you doing here? But that Do same woman, th but you're not listening to this part. You asked me a oh, question and answered the question. Go, go ahead and that, say it, that please. That same woman said yesterday, that she believes uh -huh. that Trayvon initiated the fight. Now, here's the problem. Oh, she did George not say Zimmerman that. screaming at the top she of his lungs with that. a broken nose and an eyewitness putting Trayvon, beating the crap out of him. The question then becomes what the law of Florida is. I think it's a terrible tragedy. But here's the point. You don't like the verdict, so now you want to pressure no. the president and Eric Holder to go after civil rights violations. As far as I'm concerned, that sounds like, like people that disagree with the verdict are being sore losers and now want to make this guy's well, life well, a living let, hell. Let me say this. Let me say this. We got 1.5 million and growing emails from across the country of other people that have real problems with their assessment of the evidence and how it was applied in this particular case. I hear what you're saying. Out of 300 and I million understand people. very well. That you, you and I both heard the, the right. one uh, member I have one of last the, uh, the jury. Sure, thank you. All right. Go there right were 61 deaths in Chicago. Uh, yes. 61 it's a, it's sad. deaths during just the time of the Zimmerman trial. Can you name one person by name that died in Chicago? I, I cannot. I cannot, but I, but I can tell you this. Doesn't that tell you why? I, because the, well, because well, I, want, I don't want to see kids I, I, dying, I appreciate, Hillary. I appreciate, I, this, I appreciate this talking point, but let me share something with you. Not a talking point. What, 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 t share with me one case of someone being shot to death in Chicago in which if the perpetrator was actually apprehended, they were not fully prosecuted. Well, what I'm trying to ask tell, you tell is why what? does the NAACP tell, focus tell on this why. and not focus on... Look how many black oh, on black crime that is now I, I, I a epidemic this. in Chicago. See, and see, Sean, here that, a, a jury why, why, which, acquitted this man, and you guys want to want to go after him. What, you don't like the verdict. Why not that, focus that's on what, Chicago? Uh, Sean, I, I wish you remember the NAACP and, and knew as much about us as you think you do. Quite frankly, the NAACP has been going after the issue of the murder of African American children from the very beginning. You don't beginning. know the name let of one share, of them. Let me, let, me, let me share something with you. I happen to know that uh, of African American children between 15 and 19, All right. gun violence is the number one cause of death. Will you support gun control legislation no. to help end that awful violence? No. And if you go back and look at the, the gun control legislation that was passed in 1994, you probably know that the homicide gun, gun related rate went down right, as go. a result of us actually eliminating the use of, of assault weapons. But you're not going to support that. No. Let's talk about no. what works instead of some. I think, uh, think law abiding citizens assessment. have a right to protect themselves. But I, I, well, 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 they we'll sure do, but they don't we'll, have we'll a right to go a, around a and stop discussion. African American children utilizing we'll racial profiling tactics. We'll get into a deeper discussion when we Even have Mr. Back. Zimmerman said that very well he was looking for a black person because he heard black people were burgling that's houses true. in his neighborhood. That's not yes, true. He, he never said the, that. The word got out. Listen, when it's they not, asked him why That's not true. Him, You're making he, that up. They, the, the word was out that Africa, some, uh, some African Americans had robbed a couple houses. And that's what he was looking for. It was a fact in the neighborhood. And that's how they profiled him. It was a fact. go back and look at it. Is he black, white, or Hispanic? You should listen to the entire set of right, evidence around go. this Coming case. Up now.